I'm going to log in to Alfresco using the admin username and password, which is admin and admin. Then I will search for the sample site. Just type sample and click search. There's the site. Now this is the site's dashboard and I can see a summary of what's going on in the site by looking at these dashlets and these can be customized to show just about anything you want to related to what's going on in the site. Let's look at the project library. This is where documents and files are stored in within folders. If I jump into the images folder, I can see a set of images, JPEGs, and PNG files that have already been uploaded to the site. I can change the view to change the information that shows up in the document library list. In the gallery view, I can adjust the icon sizes. Now let's click into the graph.jpg file. I can see a preview of the image on the left hand side and on the right hand side I can see the actions I can take, the properties, the metadata about the file, permissions, workflows, version history, and a publishing history. Let's go back to agency files. And let's look at the budget files. This folder contains a spreadsheet as well as some images of scanned in invoices. And now we'll jump into the presentations folder. These have Microsoft PowerPoint files. When I open up one of these files, I can preview the PowerPoint without launching PowerPoint on my desktop. Then I can flip through slide by slide through the presentation. So we've seen images previewed and we have seen office documents previewed. Let's look at a video. So if I go into agency files and scroll down to video files, there is an mp4 sitting in the folder. And if I open that, I can click play and watch the video from the video preview. Now projects um, need more than just files uh, to collaborate on. So there are other tools set up in the sample site, like the wiki. So I can open up the main wiki page and then follow some of the links including links to documents that are stored in the document library. So that's the wiki. There's also a project FAQ, which is set up using a threaded discussion. We can open up a discussion topic and see that somebody replied to one of the topics. The site includes a list of links so this is simply a collection of links and um, a set of lists. Let's look at the issue log. We can edit one of these issues, see the form that is used to capture data about issues, including links to other files in the, in the site. The task log is used to track tasks, and it has a completely different form for managing the task data.